Hi, welcome to the Insights from Dr. Intimacy YouTube webcast, and I am your host, Prophetess Lanine Hanaya, aka Dr. Intimacy, and I will be giving you an enlightening look into the naked truth about sex relationships and intimacy from the spirit, soul, and body perspective. So excited to have you back with me. I am continuing and uh, drawing to the conclusion of my series on incubus and succubus sex demons, we have had quite an extensive study on this. It's, it's been very exciting, very fruitful, and I'm going to continue with the deliverance steps. We left off in the last segment, I left off talking about step number five, consecration. And we're going to go right into step number six. Uh, and step number six is to get and study STD, sexually transmitted demons, and my book, The Spirits of Sexual Perversion Reference Book, and the Bible, because there are a lot of scriptural references in, in that book that can help you. And I'm going to just take a moment to talk about these books because they're very important. Um, I'm actually reading out of the book right now, and what it says is, if you are experiencing these attacks, it makes it apparent that you do not have a full understanding of sexual perversion and how to walk in total deliverance. Remember that any weakness in your life will invite these spirits in to attack you. You need to have a complete and full understanding of sexual intimacy, sexual activity, and sexual perversion. What it is, the purpose for it, and the remedy. You will learn this in these two books. No sexual stronghold will be able to stand in your life once you learn and apply the principles in these books, along with your personal Bible study notes. Furthermore, understanding these teachings will help you develop your intimate relationship with God the Father and strengthen all of your relationships. And I just want to definitely take a moment to highlight this important step because as I said in the last segment, deliverance is a process. It's not an event. It's a process that you're going to have to go through. And one of the steps of deliverance in the book, I talk about the 12 steps of deliverance. And one of those steps is the renewing of the mind. You know, the scripture says to be transformed by the renewing of the mind. And a lot of times what happens is you watch a good video like like you've seen in this series and you're very excited and uh, you feel changed. Maybe you go to a really great conference or revival and you feel changed, but there's no longevity to the change. You will find that within a couple of days, weeks or months, you return to whatever it was that you that you changed from. And that's the problem with change. Change can be temporary. Uh, change is not permanent. But the Bible says to be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. See, change is temporary, but transformation is permanent. When you are transformed, you can never go back to what you were before that transformation took place. And so the reason that I encourage you to get these books is because this is what is going to help renew the mind for that transformation. Not a temporary change, but a complete transformation from who you are now to who you really want to be in Christ and in the kingdom. Um, let's start with uh, STDs. I haven't shown you this one. This is STD Sexually Transmitted Demons. This is a powerful little book, and if you don't write, like reading long books, this is a great book. It's actually less than 100 pages. It's written in really simplistic language. I actually wrote it with young people in mind, um, uh, teenagers and young adults, but I have found that the older people have been just as overwhelmingly blessed by it as the young people. This is an easy read, something that you can sit down and probably finish at bedtime, but it is so, so powerful. It really breaks down what happens spiritually when you have sex. 
It is talking about the spiritual dynamics of what happens, demonic transfer, how it affects your personality, your character, your relationship with your parents. Uh, it talks about deliverance. It talks about worship, passion, how to deal with how to deal with physical sex, the natural urge to want to have sex, not the demonic part, but just that natural urge of what do you do with that. Um, it talks about soul ties. It really digs into soul ties. This is a great book. It's a testimonial. I tell a lot of stories about my life in here. When I first began having uh, sex when I was 15 years old, I talk about those stories and how I became very promiscuous very quickly after that first encounter and how it just really destroyed the fabric of my life. And so this is really going to give you an in-depth understanding of, of uh, how demons work in your life sexually, what happens when you have sex, and what's going on spiritually. And that's STD, Sexually Transmitted Demons. You get this book first, you read it. It's a sh short, quick, easy read. And then you go to college. <laughs> you go to college with the, the big book. Uh the Spirits of Sexual Perversion reference book. And this is this book is um, almost 300 pages. It's maybe about 280 pages. It's something that you want to digest very slowly, reading maybe 5 to 10 pages a day, taking a lot of notes. This is a great book for a study group, a deliverance group. It is essential for anybody that is married, Anybody that wants to get married, if you're engaged right now and uh, you're moving toward that, you want to read and study this book thoroughly before you walk down that aisle. This book can save you from divorce. I promise you. Uh, if you and your spouse-to-be uh, read this book and apply the principles to make sure that you are thoroughly delivered before you get married, you should have a seamless, carefree marriage in terms of any sexual issues in the marriage with adultery and anything like that. So you definitely want to have this book if you're already married, if you're going to get married. There's a dedicated chapter in the book that talks about marital sex. There are a lot of questions about that, and I really delve into it in the book. Uh, talk about 11 different spirits of of sexual perversion in the book, uh, fornication, masturbation, adultery, incest, homosexuality, prostitution, pornography, molestation, bestiality, sexual lust, and promiscuity. Of course, incubus and succubus is discussed. We've been reading out of it this entire time. I discuss intersexuals in their intimacy. Why did God make sex? Why did he do that to us? <laughs> you know, you're going to find that out in this book but but the best part about the book is you know it's not just studying about sexual demons but what the book really does is it opens up your intimacy with the father when you really understand why why satan introduced sexual perversion uh to the earth it was to destroy our intimate worship with yahweh the creator and when you read this book and you really begin to understand what has happened in your life, it returns you to that place of pure intimacy with him, with yourself, and with your loved ones. And it is, it is really going to enrich your worship. It is going to enrich your self-perception and your love for yourself and really, really enrich your relationship with your family and your friends and your loved ones. And if you are married, you are, uh, I can say this, you, you will begin to have the best, most passionate sex of your, of your married life after reading this book when you really begin to understand what intimacy really is and how to use it. So it's really important because this deliverance that you're going through right now or that you're going to help somebody go through, it is a process. And the transformation that happens with the renewing of the mind is essential. It is very, very important. Uh, and so I implore you to order this book. Get this book. Because if you don't get it and read it, you may change for a little while. But you might not experience that transformation that's going to give you that complete 
ultimate deliverance that you're looking for. And I'm not saying in any egotistical way that this is the only way that you can get delivered. I read a wonderful testimony from you from uh, a lady named Marie on one of the previous segments. She experienced complete and total deliverance and she never read my books. So God bless Marie that she was able to do that. But you know, this is a shortcut because I went through this for years and years and years and I wasn't able to get the help that I needed. People didn't have the knowledge to share with me. They they didn't know how to give me guidance and direction. So did I eventually get delivered? I did. I did. As I wrote this book and I got this revelation, I did eventually experience that complete deliverance. Marie did as well. But mind you, it took her over a decade. She said all throughout her teens and her 20s and into her 30s, look how long it took. Guys, this is your shortcut. This is a shortcut for you. It doesn't have to take 10 years or 15 years or 20 years or 5 years. It doesn't even have to take a year. I mean, by getting these two books and just really studying them, I really encourage you to study in a group, a study group or a cell group at your church with your girlfriends, with your, your guy friends, your spouse, your neighbors. Get together in a group and really study this book. This is your shortcut. This is your shortcut to complete and total, ultimate, utter deliverance from every spirit of sexual perversion that is afflicting you, along with the Bible. And there are, there are hundreds upon hundreds of Bible references in this book. So you'll be able to study the Bible along with the book because you can't replace the Bible with any book. No book replaces the Bible. But you'll be able to study the Bible along with this book and get such a thorough and complete uh, deliverance. So this is your shortcut. If I had this, even as I was watching back on one of the segments, uh, the last one that I did, I started laughing. And I said, where was this teaching when I needed to get delivered? Where was I? Um, but yeah, this, this, this is what I was looking for. This is what I, this is what I was looking for. And I can only give you a little bit of it uh, here on YouTube in this platform. You can get the book and you can devour it for yourself and get the complete study. So you can get these two books on my website, um, drintimacy.com, D-R-I-N-T-I-M-A-C-Y.com. The books are out of stock. They sell out quickly. However, they will be back in stock in a couple of weeks. What you want to do is when you go to the website, you're going to see the book link there and you can buy gift certificates uh, so that you can come back to the website and, and uh, use the gift certificate to purchase the book when it comes back in stock. Why do you want to do that? So that you can be sure to get one of the copies when it comes in. These books are printed in very short runs, only a hundred uh, books at a time or so, and they are usually gone within a couple of weeks. They're, they're gone. So if you buy the gift certificate, what I'm going to do, I'm going to guarantee and ensure that you get one of those printed books because you will be notified before the rest of the public is notified that the books are available. I'm actually going to personally email you and say, hey, the book is going to be out next week. And uh, you can use your gift certificate to put your order in right now. So anybody that buys a gift certificate, you're going to have that privilege uh, to know before everybody else knows. And also, the more gift certificates that are purchased, the more quickly I can restock the book and I can print more so that they won't run out so quickly. And if this has been a blessing to you, that will really be a blessing to me, just helping out with that because it has been hard. And, uh, and, and it really would be a blessing to me if you can help finance reprinting re these books by buying those gift certificates. But the important thing is that this is an important part of your deliverance process. So that is step six. My time is up for this segment. We got uh, two more steps to go in the deliverance process. Uh, I've, been, I've been so excited to have you here doing this. Um, and so come on back. Insights from Dr. Intimacy YouTube webcast. Come back to the next uh, segment so that I can continue to share with you. Share this on your social media sites so that other people can be blessed. Thanks so much.